G'day everyone and welcome back to another Star Wars figure review. Uh, next up for you today I'm going to give you a look at an exclusive figure. And that's this one here, the Lava Reflection Darth Vader. Or uh, Lava Reflection Anakin Skywalker. I always call him Anakin until he's got the um, all black armor on. Um, that's when I call him Darth Vader. But obviously at this point in the movie he was Darth Vader. But to me, he's still Anakin Skywalker. Um, as you can see, it's got the reddish orange lava reflection look to him. Also comes with this pretty decent stand. He looks um, pretty good. It's a pity that he's so poorly articulated, but um, oh well, can't complain too much, I guess. Um, he's got an interesting um, action feature. If you squeeze his legs together, he strikes with his lightsaber. Um, obviously, he's just a repack and repaint of the. Um, out the number 02 uh, Revenge of the Sith figure I think it was Anakin lightsaber attack or Anakin slashing attack one of the two I can't remember exactly which one he was called um, some people actually hate these action features and I'm not that fond of them but uh, I guess if you're a kid especially you know this this would be very cool um, I'll just run through the rest of his articulation. He's just got a swivel neck, um, the shoulders um, are ball jointed, or ball hinged actually, and just has a hinged elbow on both arms. Um, oh, this one's actually ball hinged. There they both are actually, both are ball hinged elbows and no swivel wrist on that side but this one is swivel um, his waist is kind of swivel but uh, it's more linked to the the right leg and his hips do have articulation but there's no articulation in um, the knees or the ankles Um, it's a damn shame that they didn't um, put a better Anakin figure in as the Lava Reflection one, but um, this is more of a real standing place in some sort of Mustafa scene um, than getting into any unique poses. But still, I'm very happy that I got this one, because they're certainly kind of rare. So out of 10, um, probably doesn't deserve much more than a 7 really, but um, I'm quite fond of it so I'm going to give it 7.5. I have no doubt that we'll probably see a better sculpted Anakin released in a lava reflection one of these days. And I'll be back soon to do the Obi Wan lava reflection figure as well. So until that time, may the force be with you.